Welcome to ReneeEnergy.com on YouTube, the hub for all things renewable energy and sustainability. Our channel is dedicated to bringing you the latest innovations and insights in green energy, including cutting-edge developments like green hydrogen. Whether you're a sustainability veteran or just beginning your journey, we have something for everyone. Join us on this channel to explore inspiring projects for a sustainable tomorrow. We bring you the latest in renewable energy, sustainability, and cutting-edge technologies. And don't forget, for more in-depth information and resources, visit our website and subscribe to our newsletter for the latest updates and exclusive content. In the previous episode, we introduced solid oxide electrolysis cells, SOICs, and their potential to revolutionize green hydrogen production. In this episode, we will dive deeper into the advantages of SOICs over traditional electrolyzers, such as alkaline and proton exchange membrane, PEM, electrolyzers. We will explore how the unique properties and operating principles of SOICs contribute to their superior performance and flexibility, making them a promising technology for the future of green hydrogen production. High Efficiency One of the most significant advantages of SOICs over traditional electrolyzers is their high efficiency. SOICs operate at elevated temperatures, typically between 700 degrees Celsius and 1000 degrees Celsius, which allows for a portion of the energy required for electrolysis to be provided by heat. This reduces the electrical energy input needed, resulting in higher overall system efficiency compared to low temperature electrolyzers like alkaline and PEM. The high operating temperature of SOEX enhances the ionic conductivity of the solid oxide electrolyte, which facilitates the transport of oxygen ions from the cathode to the anode. This increased ionic conductivity leads to lower ohmic losses and improved electrochemical performance. Additionally, the high temperature promotes faster reaction kinetics at the electrodes, reducing activation over potentials and further enhancing efficiency. Studies have shown that SOICs can achieve electrical efficiencies of up to 100% in ideal conditions, surpassing the typical efficiencies of alkaline, 70-80%, and PAM, 60-70%, electrolyzers. When considering the thermal energy input, the overall system efficiency of SOICs can reach values as high as 90%, making them one of the most efficient hydrogen production technologies available. Flexibility and Heat Source Integration Another key advantage of SOICs is their flexibility in terms of heat source integration. The high operating temperature of SOICs allows them to utilize various external heat sources to provide a portion of the energy required for electrolysis. This opens up opportunities for integrating SOICs with renewable or low-carbon heat sources, further improving the sustainability and efficiency of the hydrogen production process. One promising option is the integration of SOICs with nuclear power plants. Nuclear reactors generate high temperature steam that can be directly fed into the SOIC, providing both the thermal and electrical energy needed for electrolysis. This integration not only enhances the efficiency of the SOIC but also enables the production of green hydrogen using low carbon nuclear energy. Another potential heat source for SOICs is concentrated solar power, CSP. CSP systems use mirrors to concentrate sunlight and generate high temperature heat, which can be used to drive a steam turbine for electricity production. By integrating SOICs with CSP, the high temperature heat from the solar field can be directly utilized by the electrolyzer, reducing the electrical energy input and improving the overall efficiency of the system. Industrial waste heat is also a viable option for SOIC integration. Many industrial processes, such as steel production, cement manufacturing, and glass making, generate significant amounts of high temperature waste heat that is often underutilized. By coupling SOICs with these industrial processes, the waste heat can be recovered and used to drive the electrolysis reaction, resulting in improved energy efficiency and reduced greenhouse gas emissions. Reversible operation as solid oxide fuel cells. SOICs have the unique capability to operate in reverse mode as solid oxide fuel cells, SOFCs. In SOFC mode, the cell uses hydrogen and oxygen to generate electricity, rather than consuming electricity to produce hydrogen. This reversibility opens up exciting opportunities for energy storage and grid balancing applications. During periods of excess renewable electricity generation, such as during peak solar or wind power production, SOICs can be operated to convert the surplus electricity into hydrogen. The produced hydrogen can be stored and later used in the SOF mode to generate electricity when renewable energy is not available or during periods of high electricity demand. This ability to store and dispatch energy makes SOIX a valuable tool for integrating variable renewable energy sources into the power grid. The reversible operation of SOIX also enables the development of more efficient and flexible energy systems. For example, a single SOIX stack can be used for both hydrogen production and electricity generation, depending on the needs of the system. 
This dual functionality can lead to cost savings and improved overall system efficiency compared to having separate dedicated devices for each operation. Reduced rare earth metal dependency. Traditional PEM electrolyzers rely on precious metal catalysts, such as platinum and iridium, which are expensive and have limited global reserves. In contrast, SOIX can utilize more abundant and lower cost materials for their electrodes and electrolytes, reducing the dependency on rare earth metals. The most common materials used in SOIX are nickel based cermets for the cathode, perovskite oxides for the anode, and yttria stabilized zirconia YSZ, for the solid oxide electrolyte. These materials are relatively abundant, less expensive, and have demonstrated good performance and durability in SOIX operation. The reduced reliance on precious metal catalysts in SOIX can help mitigate potential supply chain bottlenecks and price volatility associated with rare earth metals. This is particularly important considering the projected growth in hydrogen production capacity needed to support the transition to a clean energy future. However, it is worth noting that some SOIC designs may still incorporate small amounts of rare earth elements, such as lanthanum and cerium, in the electrode or electrolyte materials to enhance performance or stability. Ongoing research efforts aim to further optimize SOIC material compositions and minimize the use of critical raw materials. Potential for cost reduction. The high efficiency, Flexibility in heat source integration, and reduced dependency on rare earth metals in SOIX all contribute to their potential for cost reduction compared to traditional electrolyzers. As SOIX technology advances and scales up, several factors are expected to drive down the cost of hydrogen production. Firstly, the high efficiency of SOIX means that less electricity is required to produce a given amount of hydrogen compared to alkaline or PEM electrolyzers. This directly translates to lower operating costs, as electricity often accounts for a significant portion of the total cost of hydrogen production. Secondly, the ability to integrate SOIX with various heat sources, including renewable and waste heat, can further reduce the cost of hydrogen production. By utilizing low-cost or free heat sources, the energy input costs for SOIX can be minimized, making the process more economically attractive. Thirdly, as SOIC technology matures and production volumes increase, economies of scale are expected to drive down the manufacturing and capital costs of SOIC systems. Advances in materials, cell design, and manufacturing processes will also contribute to cost reductions over time. Several techno-economic studies have projected that the cost of hydrogen produced by SOICs could become competitive with that of fossil fuel-based hydrogen in the near future, especially when considering carbon pricing or other policy incentives. As the demand for green hydrogen grows and SOIC technology continues to develop, the cost gap between SOIC-based hydrogen and conventional hydrogen production methods is expected to narrow further. Conclusion In this episode, we have explored the key advantages of solid oxide electrolysis cells SOICs, over traditional alkaline and PEM electrolyzers. The high efficiency, flexibility and heat source integration, reversible operation as solid oxide fuel cells, reduced dependency on rare earth metals, and potential for cost reduction makes SOIX a promising technology for green hydrogen production. As we continue to transition towards a clean energy future, SOIX are poised to play a significant role in enabling the widespread adoption of hydrogen as a versatile and sustainable energy carrier. The unique properties and capabilities of SOIX align well with the growing demand for efficient, flexible, and cost-effective hydrogen production methods. In the next episode, we will delve into the integration of SOICs with renewable energy sources, such as solar, wind, and geothermal power. We will explore how the coupling of SOICs with these renewable energy technologies can further enhance the sustainability and economic viability of green hydrogen production. Thank you for joining us in this episode, and we look forward to having you with us in the upcoming episodes as we continue to explore the exciting world of solid oxide electrolysis cells and their role in shaping the future of green hydrogen production. Thanks for tuning into the ReneeEnergy.com YouTube channel. We trust you found this episode enlightening and motivating. There's a world of innovation and opportunity in sustainable energy, and we're delighted to share this journey with you. Stay in the loop with the latest on renewable energy and sustainability by visiting our website and subscribing to our newsletter. Your support is immensely appreciated, it's truly invaluable to us. Don't miss our next video on new trends in renewable energy. Follow us on social media for the latest updates. Enjoyed the video? Like, subscribe, and share for more green insights. Thanks for watching.